Hey everybody, Jace and Ange. We decided to pit stop in Athens and we knew that there was a hole. Start right That's good. Hey everybody, Jason and Ange. Stop laughing, Jason. <laughs> Why are you even laughing? I don't know. I, I don't know. We're not going to get through okay, it. Okay, you're right. You ready? Uh, Here we go. Hey everybody. <laughs> you gave me the look. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Just get through it. We're never going to make it. It's going to get dark. Hey everybody, Jason and. Hey Every everybody, it's Ange and Jace, and we're standing in Athens, Georgia. We decided to pit stop in Athens. We knew that there was a whole lot of cooler things here than just college football, which there is cool college football. There's cool. There's lots of dogs walking around too. But if you're local, you've already heard about this place. And if you're not local, you should definitely come and check it out. Why Georgia? It's where our story begins. Boy meets girl. Seventh grade boy's first girlfriend. Fast forward through life's journey, boy reunites with girl and marries her 27 years later. Aww. So naturally, it felt like the best place to start. And what better town than the college town of Athens, Georgia, home of the University of Georgia, and more notably, Uga, that infamous bulldog. One of the first things we noticed when we rolled into Athens was how cool the buildings were. So much history in this college town. Here's a fun fact. The Georgia Theater and the 40 Watt Club are not only the birthplace of modern alternative rock, they boast music legends like Widespread Panic, the B-52s, and R.E.M. But it's also home to four stellar breweries. And guess what? They all have to give you beer. What? Stop it. Why? Well, it's illegal for them to sell it to you. Georgia is one of only two states left in the country with pre-prohibition laws preventing a brewery to sell its product to the public. It's as outdated as, I don't know, fake wood paneling on a station wagon. Step into the 21st century already, Georgia. So how do they get around it? Well, they sell you a tour. Once the tour's over, you get the best souvenir ever, beer samples. It does have its limits. The brewery only sells the responsible on-site consumption limit of 36 ounces to each patron. There is a light at the end of the tunnel though. Due to recent revisions to Georgia law, you can purchase a six pack to go upon completing your tour. We had just enough time to stop into Creature Comforts Brewery, an excellent choice from start to finish. This pet-friendly realm of curiosity, you can't help but wonder how the once abandoned building from the 40s has turned into this genuine work of art. The building was originally built as a Chevy dealership, which later transformed into the Snow Tire Company. Its memory is seen all over the walls of Creature Comforts with ever so witty marketing of yesterday and today. From what appears to be original industrial garage doors to the resurrection of the building's reclaimed wood, your senses immediately step back in time. A magnificent transformation to say the least, as Creature Comforts pridefully displays its award for outstanding rehabilitation by the Athens Heritage Foundation. All right, so it's time for our sweet nectar of the week. What was yours, babe? Mmm, it would have to be the Tropicalia. If you're afraid of hops, don't be. This is an American IPA. It starts really citrusy and then it's flavored so precise that you can only taste passion fruit at the end. It has a tinge of bitterness, which makes it a beginner IPA for me. A tinge. A tinge. A tinge. Mm -hmm. It's All right. so delicious <laughs> that on the way out of town, we stopped to split one, remember? Yes, we did. So what was yours? I'm gonna have to go with the Athena. This beer, it tiptoes around being a sour, which we're both getting used to, but I like it a whole bunch. It's a German-inspired white brew, goes through a double fermentation process. I, I don't know, it's a total yum for me. Don't forget, the brew United States is big. We don't find these places, you do. So keep sharing, stay crafty, and drink responsibly.